Previously, the Audi A5 Sportback was an ostensibly more practical four-door version of the slinky A5 coupe. That relationship changes multilaterally for 2025, however, as the A5 coupe and convertible are discontinued and Audi streamlines its lineup to better delineate gas and EV models. The now four-door only A5 also then serves as a replacement for the gas-powered A4 sedan, which could become an EV in the near future. Audi says the new A5 sedan is longer, wider, and taller than the current A5 Sportback. The wheelbase is stretched helping to provide good rear seat and cargo space. In addition to the all-new styling for the slope-backed four-door, the level of standard equipment improves with navigation, wireless smartphone charging, and a power hatch. A turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder with 268 horsepower and a 48-volt hybrid system is the only powertrain with AV6 hybrid reserved for the S5. A DSG dual-clutch transmission handles gear swaps and all-wheel drive is standard, nearly everything, as an all-new generation of A5 launches in 2025. The new A5 sedan features a slightly larger profile, a more powerful turbo 4 engine, a reportedly stiffer chassis, and new tech with larger infotainment screen options. If that sounds overwhelming, Audi Faithful can take solace in the fact that the current A5 Sportback and A4 sedan will remain on sale as 2025 models alongside the new A5 for the near future and will eventually phase out the A4 sedan. Going forward, Audi will transition on all even-numbered names for EVs. Additionally, the 2025 A5 four-door drops the Sportback tag and is now officially known as a sedan despite retaining a fastback body style. Engine, transmission, and performance, the new 2025 A5 will launch in the US with a single powertrain comprised of a turbocharged 268 horsepower 2.0-liter turbocharged 4 assisted by a 48-volt hybrid system. No manual transmission is available, as a dual-clutch automatic handles gear swaps for the A5 as well as its high-performance V6-powered S5 sibling. Suspension tweaks are still TBA, but Audi claims the new A5 has stiffer suspension and steering mounts and that adaptive dampers, a torque vectoring rear differential, and sport suspension will be available. The Legacy A5 continues with a turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder available in two outputs, the 40 with 201 horsepower and the 45 with 261 horses. Power goes through a standard 7-speed dual-clutch transmission and standard Quattro all-wheel drive, it's been a minute since we gathered performance data on an A5 Sportback, and we are eager to see if the new A5's slight boost in overall output, combined with the instantaneous torque boost of the hybrid system, makes for a quicker A5. EPA fuel economy estimates are not yet available for the new 2025 A5 sedan. The current A5 Sportback has EPA estimates 26 miles per gallon in the city and 35 miles per gallon on the highway. The A5 built a reputation for its high-quality materials, top-notch fit and finish, and a bundle of high-end features that distance the A5 from mainstream sedans. The current A5's list of standard features includes power front seats, leather upholstery, a panoramic sunroof, ambient interior lighting, and three-zone climate control as standard kit, a trend we expect the new A5 to continue. Audi says the new A5 sedan provides 26 cubic feet of cargo space, over four more than the 22 cubes of the current A5 Sportback. That's impressive, as the current A5 Sportback beat all its direct rivals in our real-world cargo test. The new A5 presents a large, curved glass panel that houses an 11.9-inch instrument panel display and a 14.5-inch infotainment touchscreen. The instrument portion includes a digital speedometer, a small strip tachometer, fuel level indicator, audio and navigation information, and a display of what's around you in traffic. Gone is the ability to select which types of gauges you prefer. Early experimentation with the infotainment reveals quick responses and an intuitive menu structure. To its right resides an optional 10.9-inch rectangular screen for the passenger. Though it seems a bit haphazardly placed, it's designed to be seen only by the passenger when the vehicle is moving. There's also a new head-up display with integrated vehicle and infotainment indicators, including speed, navigation instructions, assistant system information, and the current audio selection. The price of the 2025 Audi A5 sedan Sportback is expected to start around $47.225 and go up to $57.00 depending on the trim and options, with pricing still unconfirmed for the new version, it's hard to zero in on a single choice. 
the current mid-level Premium Plus, which will be sold alongside the new 2025 A5 for a short period, brings a nice blend of equipment and a Bang Olufsen stereo system, add the more powerful 45-spec engine, and you've got a desirable package. As for the new version, Audi says the order books for German customers will open in July 2024, but its official international launch is in November 2024. We'll update this story with complete details when pricing and spec data for the new 2025 Audi A5 become available.